Hey, this is Susie J. Cobwebs. And how are you doing today? Are you saving money? This is a video that's going to figure out how you can find your why to saving money. Have you ever thought about saving money, but then you may or may not have the reason why? I am sure that there are a lot of things out there that you want to purchase, but maybe you don't have the money for. Would you just save money because rainy day? Or maybe it's just you didn't find something that you really don't need and you're just storing your money away. I thought I would just have a conversation with you. And I think this is going to be a good talk about saving money. Is there something that you were saving up for? A vacation, a vehicle, to pay your bills off, pay your credit card off, maybe a down payment on a house. Maybe you wanna go back to college and you need to have some spending money while you're in class. Are you still trying to make a name for yourself when you were building your brand of, or your social media platforms? What about paying off debt, college tuition, medical expenses? There could be so many different reasons why you are wanting to or you are saving money. Then you say to yourself, you know that your paycheck is a really strapped because you have to pay all the bills or the rest of the bills. So what can I do with that? Well, if you have a little bit of extra time in your day, why don't you babysit, grass cut for the neighbor, or even use some of your services as a virtual assistant. Try to do a side hustle. This could bring a little bit more money into your pocket that maybe you could add straight to your savings that you just opened, by the way. I know it may not be much, but this is something that will grow in time. So yes, you are working on your extra time. Yes. And you're really not taking away from your bill money. So there's really not much really money lost, but only a money gain. And make sure that you add this to your savings account. This is a place where you really don't have easy access to get it out. You can get it in, but you can't get it out. When I made my savings account, I made sure that there was a hard way for me not to get it out. I didn't bring a debit card. I don't have any cards associated with that account. I have to physically go to the bank to make a transfer if I have to. Now, this will also say, do I really need this money? Can I figure out another way to get money other than taking it out of my savings? So you have to know why you are saving money. And this will help. One of the things that could be helpful is in this savings account registrar that you have, say you write in there, it's a vehicle that you want to purchase. Even if you say, I'm going to plaster this all over my mirror that I look at every morning when I get dressed for the day, it's still in your savings account registrar. What about making a grocery list and sticking to it? Is there any way possible that you could save money with a grocery bill? Here is a, a way that you could save money, but over a long period of time. I know that there is going to be times where you want to go on vacation, or if you just want to go out for an evening with your friends. Here's my thought process. If you have enough money out of your bill money, you can go. If you do not, you do not attend. Now, I'm sorry, this could sound a little bit harsh, but you want to save your money. And unfortunately, there's, you have sacrifices for now so you can get what you want later. Maybe do a monthly budget. One of the important things that you want to take out for and make it a bill is the me expense. This is more for like fun money or th something that you want to do throughout the month. And yes, this is a part of expenses and you should treat it as a bill. You don't want to deprive yourself of not having fun, which will lead you into the failure of saving money. Now, since you have all your bills in order and how you're going to pay them because you're going to pay them on time because then you won't have any late fees or anything like that or overdraft fees, late fees, all that other happy stuff. 
we don't want that. This is a great way to start saving money and to get whatever you want or for whatever you're saving for. Really, if you are just saving money to save money, that's okay. Actually, that's better than okay. This means that you are strict with yourself and you will be fine in the future. Why are you saving money? Can you comment that down below? If you like these videos and you wanna see more of these videos, by all means, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, hit that post notification button so you can stay on top of all the different things that I post. And to the next time, love you bunches.